This just came today, and I imagine you can guess what it is. Solid workout. Meat and potatoes there, not long. I'm glad I didn't wait to put this on. Couldn't. Morning, Trainiacs. Got a bit of a late start to the day. Woke up at six or so. And then crushed out today's vlog. Whole bunch of work. And now it's like just after 11 and I gotta go and get in a two hour brick workout. But you know what? I ain't complaining because the fact that it's a little bit later in the day means that I've got some decent weather here in Winnipeg. So you better believe that I'm not going on the trainer. I'm going outside. Oh, and uh, related to that, disregard everything I said in uh, this video right up there about how much better trainer rides are because they're so efficient. Uh, yeah, that video is blowing up at the moment and uh, I'm completely disregarding it. Was a solid, solid workout. Meat and potatoes there, not long, but good work. We did that hour and 16 minute bike with 36 minutes of it, well above race pace. Like, get some snap into the legs, and then that 30 minute run was supposed to be zone two, so we're talking for me that would be just under five minute kilometers, like 745 minute miles. I was down at four and a half minute kilometers, something like, uh, like just over a seven minute mile and felt steady. I know I said this before Campeche, but I'm feeling dangerous for Austin. I mean it this time. So, you know what? Given that this here is future triathlon Terran HQ, and I think like somewhere right around Let's go just past the rusty nail. Somewhere right here is gonna be where the couch is that I'll be doing a ton of unboxing. This just came today, and I imagine you can guess what it is. Alright, so in this box we have a male Torque Pro swim skin. We also have a Tear Hurricane Cat 5 wetsuit in black and red. Okay. Sir, caution when handling the speed suit to so avoid damaging material. Oh, this is, this is the speed suit. This is the speed suit? Oh no. I get it. I see what's happening here. To put on the speed suit, have they actually, they have actually given me gloves. So you don't put fingernail tears in your wetsuit or your speed suit. Makes perfect sense because if you've seen, I've been a big hoob guy for the last year and a half or so, had some tears in it. I have to imagine that some of that has to do with me putting some fingernails in it and like giving it a yank in the wrong spot. So uh, 
This is not the worst idea. Got this cute little baggie to put it in too. Goodness. For years, athletes have chosen the Hurricane Wetsuit Series for its unbeatable quality, fit, and performance. Tier has now remodeled the line to maximize performance even further, while specifically catering to various levels of competition. All different levels of competition! Each suit is strategically engineered to enhance your buoyancy, acceleration, and overall power in the water. Those are three things that I love. Okay, so why I reached out to Tier specifically for this Cat 5 suit to give it a try is because it's got a lot of the features that I liked about the Hoob, a lot of the features that I really liked about the Roka, Maverick. Basically, it's everything that you could want if you haven't grown up swimming and you need a little bit of extra buoyancy in a few different areas and you aren't like a pure natural swimmer who haven't grown up with it. Okay, I don't have time to get to this and that. And frankly, uh, I've never even been in a tier wetsuit or swim skin. So, uh, give me a little while. I think it might still be warm enough out here in the Peg City to uh, get out and convince Coach Pat to do an open water swim with me tomorrow and test this out. Mm -hmm. All right, thank you, tier. And uh, who's excited for Triathlon Terran HQ on this ginormous concrete pad? I couldn't resist. Look at this. It's just, fits so nice. It's just so, so stretchy. Ooh, it feels all contoured. Ooh, yeah. And bam, we got ourselves a swim skin here. I like this. I don't know if you noticed, but that, it's like the triathlon Terran little grid lines from the roadmap on the Trainiac kits. Keep you nice and sucked in and hydrodynamic. I don't know if you can see that or not, but it kind of feels like, I've never felt shark skin, but it's actually got a, a texture to it. It goes down. No, sharks are very rough. If they brush up against you, you can get cut. Sharks are smooth. False. I'm glad I didn't wait to put this on. Couldn't. Could not wait. All right, later.